in the summertime, people go to restaurants not only for a good meal, but sometimes also to cool off and escape the hot weather. But now that President Carter has ordered thermostats up to 78 degrees, restaurants aren't all that cool, and customers are noticing. Well, it's not really uncomfortable. I've eaten here several times, and uh, I can tell it's warmer, but you know, it doesn't bother me. And I tend to eat more ice cream for dessert, which I shouldn't do. <laughs> but I do all fan myself in the uh, restaurants. And I've thought before of saying something to a proprietor about, you know, not having any air conditioning. Well, it's not as comfortable, but I support the president's um, uh, decision about it. I think we need to conserve energy. And, um, and I think Americans are going to have to get used to it. Have you noticed a difference from your customers because of the uh, temperature being up? Uh, somewhat in their attitude. They seem to be a little less tolerant you know, of service and stuff like that. Most of them want you to do something. And what can we do? We just have to comply. I'd imagine a lot of them are coming in here because they expect a public place to be a little cooler than home. And then when they get here and find out, they might as well have stayed home. Or Especially if they're paying for a service, you know, they like to enjoy it in comfort. And uh, 78 degrees is not helping that at all. But some like it hot. I prefer it warmer. The, usually the air conditioning is so cold that it's very disturbing to come in and outside of buildings. And with the warmer temperatures, it's much more comfortable. It feels a lot warmer in here. It used to be a lot cooler. I just have another beer, though. Cool me back down. There's been no presidential order issued, but if you're in a restaurant and feeling warm, a nice cool one could never hurt. <sighs> Mike Deason, Area 10 Eyewitness News, Norfolk.